EVT, an automotive test equipment and repair service. Your place where you can make one call to repair it all. Welcome to the first video section of the on-site training program covering the operation, maintenance, and calibration of the FMC Visual Liner, a new concept in training, the most innovative alternative to conventional automotive alignment training. In the first section of the workbook, you were introduced to the very basic controls of your alignment system. This section of the video will let you see these controls in action. As you continue with the remainder of the program, you will continue to learn about the machine and its functions. At the end of the program, you will be able to operate the aligner with ease. Before you use the aligner, read and follow the caution and warning labels. The information on these labels is to protect you, your customer, and your machine. Position your aligner in front of the alignment bay to allow maximum visibility while performing alignments. Before you plug it in, check the wall outlet. Compare it to the plug on the machine. Be sure they are compatible. Plugging the machine into the wrong outlet will damage the machine. Don't modify the plug to match an out-of-date, non-grounded outlet or extension cord. The unit's on-off switch is on the rear of the upper console. The switch is marked with an O for the off position and an I for the initiate the program, or in simple terms, power on. The circuit breaker you see near the power switch is designed to protect the machine against overloads. If it trips, check and eliminate the overload and reset the breaker. When you turn the machine off, the machine responds by displaying the date entry screen. And if your machine is equipped with the optional printer, you'll hear the printer begin to move. If your machine is equipped with the on-site training option, you are probably viewing this tape on the training system player. The controls for the system are on the front cabinet. The switch is labeled video for video cassette player and align to display your alignment readings. In this first section, we just wanted to introduce you to the machine, and we hope you like what you saw. When the screen fades to black, turn the tape player off and return the video align switch to align. Take a look at the rest of the machine. Pay close attention to the keyboard. You'll learn more about it in the next section.